Hi, my name is Patrick Durkin. I'm Dylan Johnson. Welcome to another WJCA broadcast. First off, we have Patrick Durkin interviewing Coach Jaws and Coach Voss and Dad Jokes Part 2. How do you follow Will Smith in the snow? You get jiggy with it. <laughs> follow the Fresh Prince. <laughs> All right. You can't laugh in the background. <laughs> Where do you learn to make a banana split? Where do you learn uh, Sunday school? I only know 25 letters of the alphabet. How many letters are in the alphabet? 32? It's <laughs> <laughs> math. Oh, that's edited it out. It's not even a joke. I don't trust those trees. A bunch of leaves. These things are shady. I thought for sure I could see that one. It's hard not to laugh. See, holding it in. All it takes is one. Dirk, these are terrible jokes, by the way. My wife said I should do lunches to stay in shape. That'd be a big step forward. Lunches? Lunches. Oh, lunges. lunges. I thought you said lunches. Be a big step forward. Gotcha. Uh, I don't trust stairs. Kind of the same joke as the trees. Are we going down? No, they're up to something. Really held that one in good. Really held that one in good. Almost got you for sure. That's a half a point. What do you call a woman with one leg? Tight. Is her last name Dover? Durkin, were you better than this? I'm oh, pretty much out. I mean, I have a couple inappropriate ones here, but I, I did not rate them. Um, why don't chickens wear underwear? I got an answer, but I'm not going to say it. Because their beak is on their face. What did the janitor say when he jumped out of the closet? Gotcha! Supplies! Wow, those are some funny dad jokes. Next, Samantha Patrick interviewed Miss Cavillas during Pi Day. Three point one four one five nine two six five three five eight nine seven nine three two three eight four six two six three three eight three two seven nine five. Hi, I'm Samantha Patrick here with Miss Villas. So, can you tell us about what you and the math department did for Pi Day? So, we wanted to kind of represent how big of a number Pi is because it continues on and on forever. So, we made a big chain that represents the first over 5,000 digits of Pi. We didn't make it all the way to the end, but we did our best. Thank you. Wow, looks like it, they had a lot of fun during Pi Day. Next up, we have Madison Patrick interviewing Miss Buzz and Luke Peekle about their achievements in Key Club. Hi, I'm Madison Patrick and I'm here with Luke Peekle and Miss Buzz. Congratulations on your first place award for your service project, Kemis. Can you tell us more about this? Yes, yeah, so out of all the schools in Illinois, everyone has a service section, so like a Key Club, um, lots of Key Clubs, and you can apply. Um, for your service project of the year. So Zach and Luke Peekle put together this amazing report. It was like 27 pages about chemists that we did um, in December. So it was like 12 days of service and we did it like every morning or afternoon. 
Um, and then we applied and then out of our division, since we're a smaller school, we were in the silver division and we won. We won um, best service project of the year in that division for the state of Illinois and Eastern Iowa. That's awesome, congratulations. And what can this award lead you to? So now that we won first place in Illinois, um, we can apply to um, be, well, we can be nominated for the international convention. So Key Club is worldwide. It's all in uh, a lot of America and then um, South America. So they all compete in the international convention that's in July and we will be in for the silver division. And Luke, can you tell us about your individual award? Yes, I was named Distinguished Vice President and in order to be named that, there's a set of criteria you have to meet and each standard is on a point scale. And since I received over 20 points, I was named Distinguished Vice President and I also completed over 100 hours of service in the school year, so I was given an award for that. That's amazing. Thanks a lot for meeting with me and congratulations on being state champions in service. That's all we have for you this week. Reminder, next week is Spring Fling Week and all the details about it have been emailed out to everybody at JCA. Thanks for watching. Go, go, go. go. For more information, please visit our website.